welcome 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 if you're new to the channel subscribe hit that notification bell going on y'all welcome to the channel if you're new subscribe hit that notification bell I'm gonna take y'all on the tour through all lower east side hoods in lower Manhattan going on what's going on over here we got the Brooklyn Bridge this is the first hood in Manhattan beginning of Manhattan this is the first projects in Manhattan lower east side this goes all the way up to Harlem East Harlem. Right now I'm walking through Smith Projects. It's the first projects in Manhattan, Low East Side. total of 12 buildings they go up to 17 floors very big high-rise buildings you go on a roof you can see the whole city they have a school in the development Drive and the Brooklyn Bridge. And that's Battery Park. That's the city. All the way in the beginning. Where the ferry's at. Staten Island Ferry, if you don't know. <clears throat> so for the six viewers that's here, uh, if you're new to the channel, subscribe. Hit that notification bell. I'm about to take y'all through all the hoods in the Lower East Side Manhattan section. From Smith all the way to Jacob Rees. As you can see, they had built a lot of buildings by the development, expensive buildings. I guess for the middle class. This is the school that's in the development. It's a new park they built. the FDR Drive and the Brooklyn Bridge. Straight ahead, we got the Manhattan Bridge. And there's the new park they built. Straight ahead, that's the Manhattan Bridge. We 
exiting it out the hood now. Once again, we just walked through Smith Projects and Lower East Side First Projects in Manhattan. Once you enter Manhattan, that's the first project, the Smith Projects. Just exited out of Smith. Gonna keep walking down. Uh, the next Nitro development is uh, Rutgers. Rucker Projects. Uh, very small. I think they got four buildings. I think they go up to 20 floors. If y'all new to the channel, subscribe. Hit that notification bell for more daily content and live videos. If you enjoy this content, please subscribe and hit the notification bell for more daily content and live videos. Right here is uh, Knickerbocker. It's more like a private complex. Nickelbacca's private complex. Yes, indeed, brother. I'm by Catherine Slip. Well, just left from that area. Uh, I'm heading to Rutgers now. This is Nickelbacca, though. It's a private complex. It's the park they built. Fixed it up. What's going on, my G? Anything at? Yeah. Uh, they did the basketball court over. It's the Manhattan Bridge. Yeah, facts. That's what I'm heading to now, Rutgers. Uh, we just left out of Smith Projects. Right here's the Manhattan Bridge and the other side of the FDR. This FDR takes you all the way up past Harlem. What's going on, y'all? What's going on? If y'all new to the channel, please subscribe. Hit that notification bell for more daily content and live videos. If you just got here, uh, we left Smith House's uh, first projects on the Lower East Side, Manhattan. We're heading towards Rutgers now. We're gonna walk through all the projects on the Lower East Side. <clears throat> this is Nickelbacker. Y'all wondering what's that sound? That's the train crossing the Manhattan Bridge. Must be high because it's not that bad. <clears throat> they go all the graffiti. That's the skate skateboard park. If y'all missed it, this is the uh, baseball field. Yeah, 
it's not that bad out for some reason. This weather been a little strange this year. Uh, right now I'm walking in the underpath. I'm under the Manhattan Bridge where the train runs at. It gets spooky at night. <laughs> To my 15 viewers, what's going on, y'all? Yes, I'm going. I'm going to hit Valadix, Baruch, all that. Yes, I'm going to hit all that, fam. We ain't leaving nothing out on the Lower East Side. All right. So right now, y'all, <clears throat> this is Rucker Projects. Rucker's is the second projects next to Smith, which is only like. I would say two blocks away. Uh, Rutgers is the second projects in Manhattan, on the Lower East Side. Uh, like I said, it's only about four buildings. Very spaced out. I think they go up to 20 floors. They're very big high rise buildings in Manhattan. Like I said, all the Manhattan projects, all the projects in Manhattan are very, very tall high rise buildings. You have some small ones, but most most of them are very tall. But you got projects like Polo Grounds. They go up to like 25 floors. I see it here. It's Rocket Projects, Lower East Side Manhattan. I'm gonna cut through here. Uh, then right here, they just built some <laughs> upper class, I guess, rental building right across the street. So y'all see what they trying to do? Clean shit up. Excuse my French. They trying to clean things up. Walk in and scream whoop D. Nah, we don't promote that on here, fam. Haha, <laughs> from the Bobcat you be driving? <laughs> so you do the housing thing, that's what's up. So right now we walking through the parking lot of Rucker Projects. And Rutgers, right across the street, they got LaGuardia. It's like right across the street. Sometimes people can't even tell. Well, if you're not from the area, sometimes they can't even tell the two. Well, shout outs to you, brother. Holding it down for the housing. Keeping the buildings clean. Keeping the hallways clean. Because we know how to get in them elevators with, you know, pissing the elevators and, you know, People don't be picking up their dog poop. Right here, so this is the basketball court in Rutgers. This hood is like pretty, like people hang on the outskirts, so this is kind of like a dead hood sometimes. That's what's up, fam. Keeping it clean for our community. That's what it's about. Shout outs to you. Shout outs to the whole NYCHA. You know, for the ones that's out there, the grounds people and the buildings people, you know, keeping the community clean. You know, it's rough. People don't understand. It's real rough. You know, I commend y'all for that. If y'all new to the channel, though, subscribe. Hit that notification bell. It's the playground. So as y'all can see, this is building one, building two, building three, building four. So they got five buildings. Building five. My bad, y'all. I thought it was four. Even sometimes I get confused, and I'm from the city. So it's five buildings. Uh, before I walk through LaGuardia, I'm going to cut through on the Ave. Yeah, I'm gonna cut through here on the app because this is where like most activities at. People don't really chill inside Rutgers, they be on the outskirts, like I said. 
<clears throat> you know? So a lot of people wanna, a lot of people wanna know why do I do these videos is to show people all around the world what it's like inside NYCHA, how it looks on the inside. We do not promote any violence, any negative vibes on this channel. This channel is strictly positive and we try to keep this PG as much as possible. You know, all I do is report inside NYCHA in all the neighborhoods in Manhattan and all over the world. This is the community center, well, hopefully all over the world. school over there. So this is mostly where it's active at. The local store, got the chicken spot, Manhattan Bridge over there, you know. Uh, I've, I've been filming in Brooklyn, fam. I've been filming to Michael Robinson. I've been filming in Brooklyn heavy. You know, I just, you know, I'm very strategic on how I release my content. You know, I try to, you know, space it out as much as possible. As you can see, you know, everybody chilling on the block. You know, I try not to put the camera in nobody's face like that, cause, you know, I wouldn't want no camera in my face, but. You know, but I'm just filming. You know what I mean? If you in the way, you in the vlog, straight up. So right here, we about to enter LaGuardia Projects. This is the third project in Manhattan on the Lower East Side. As y'all can see, this is nice, man. The Christmas spirit, man. Uh, you know, this is nice, man. Very religious and respectful right here. It's the Guardia houses. So I'm gonna cut in the middle. You know what I mean? So for the 17 viewers, man, what's going on, y'all? What's up, man? If y'all new to the channel, please subscribe. Hit that notification bell for more daily content and live videos. Right now, we're about to walk through LaGuardia houses on the Lower East Side. Just know when I fight out, it's over. Yeah, so right now, we're walking through LaGuardia projects. It's the third projects on the East Side. Third projects in Manhattan. Lower East Side Manhattan. I'm not sure how many buildings they got out here. I don't really come through here that much. Yo, what's up? This nigga shouting out the window, pointing the language. I'm shouting out the window, saying what I'm recording. <laughs> Come downstairs and see. So there's LaGuardia. Now, another thing, I do these hood vlogs because you know, just to show the world, like I said, how it is inside NYCHA. You know, some people do get offended by it, but you know, that's a part of life, you know? Can't please everybody, you know what I mean? But I'm qualified, well qualified, you know, to do this, you know, because I come from this, you know? Just to give you an update on that. So, there's LaGuardia. <clears throat> but I will be doing more videos, live videos like this in other boroughs and hopefully all over the world. Brooklyn, Bronx, Queens, Staten Island. Right here is they pop. I'm trying to get everything to show y'all. 
Used to live here. That's what's up. Shout outs to you. Shout outs LaGuardia. Not my hood, but much respect. Besides the crime. That night shit isn't bad. Nah, not at all, fam. It's what you make of it. It's what you make of it. I was raised in Nature my whole life. You know, I got a lot of great memories here. A lot of great childhood memories. You know? Yes. <laughs> it's a baddie. Yes. Big rats on the Lower East Side. That's a fact. <laughs> yes. She know. <laughs> Throwing out the trash and the incinerator. Yeah. You know how I get. So LaGuardia, this is my first time walking through LaGuardia, to be honest. And, hold on, let me catch over here. I don't want this nothing. I'm trying to get the whole view for y'all. So, I mean, let's see how I look. Through and through. Yeah, so, LaGuardia got three sides. It's my first time even noticing that. What's going on, everybody? If y'all new to the channel, please subscribe, hit that notification bell for more daily content and live videos. So there's the third side of LaGuardia. This side's pretty tight. Buildings are much more closer. Okay, you in Philly now, it's a baddie? That's what's up, shout outs to Philly. You know, I moved out of the city a few times before too and I understand what you mean. You could miss it a lot. Word. You know? Ain't no city like New York City. No disrespect. For my 20 viewers, man, if y'all new here, please subscribe to the channel. Hit that notification bell for more daily content and live videos. So we about done here. We about to leave out of here. So right across the street, it's more like a private property, not necessarily NYCHA. The next hood after this is Veladix. <coughs> it's the fourth hood in Manhattan, Lower East Side Manhattan. Let me just cut through here. Right here, this is not a project, this is private property. Yes, that's what it's all about, saving the youth. You know, that's the next step. I'm all for that. Supporting the youth, you know? It's 
So right now, this is Veladix Projects, the fourth projects in Manhattan, Lower East Side. <clears throat> like I said, y'all new to the channel, please subscribe, hit that notification bell for more daily content and live videos. Right now, we're entering Veladix Projects, much smaller high-rise buildings way much more buildings than the last three projects. Right now we're entering the Latix. Yes, shout out to the Bronx and Harlem. So this is the Latix projects on the lower east side. Uh, let me see. I'm trying to see where should I. I'm gonna take the back end and come back up. I ain't gonna lie, this hood is very confusing as far as the ground and how they got this set up. They got their mailboxes outside. Uh, like I said, much smaller high rise buildings, but a whole bunch, a whole bunch of them. As you can see. my 24 viewers man what's going on y'all if y'all new to the channel please subscribe hit that notification bell for more daily content and live videos say low pop i've never really been through velatics like that very clean <laughs> probably the cleanest hood i've ever been in to be honest Clean and the quietest hood at that. This is extreme. They got gardens and all that. Not like your regular nice development. They keeping it real clean over here. You want to So yeah, this is Veladix Projects, the fourth projects. I'm in Veladix right now, Mike Robinson. I'm in Veladix, the fourth hood in Manhattan, the fourth projects in the Lower East Side. You know? Like I said, smaller high rise buildings, but you know, a whole bunch of them. I'm not sure how many buildings they got. It could be like 15. Another thing, man, this is what we got to do better at right here. You know? This is what we got to do better out, man. Shout outs to the housing workers that really do work, but this right here is unacceptable. You know, as a community, we cannot keep allowing this. This is unacceptable, man. I mean, we just got to, and this is why I do these videos for, 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 for issues like this too. You know, because this is why we got rats in the hood and roaches and everything. It's crazy. Infestation. I mean, this is not a good job. I know it's the holidays. Most of them probably on vacation, but I mean, we got to do a better job, man. Housing got to do a better job, man. You know I mean, if y'all agree, man, hit a thumbs up if y'all agree. Housing got to do a better job, man. Please, man. Please, thumbs up if housing got to do a better job crazy look at all this man but for the most part this hood is very clean i mean they keep the ground clean i ain't see no dog poop on the floor yet yeah man thumbs up if housing got to do a better job keeping the community clean man which barrel has the most rest my brother keith to be honest it gotta be the, I mean, what the barrels I, I, the projects I've been in, it gotta be the, the Bronx or Manhattan. 
in my opinion, and I mean, other people might think otherwise, but the Bronx or Manhattan got the most rats, and that's no disrespect. That's just bad housing workers, you know? Bad community workers, you know what I mean? But for you who's just tuning in, man, we in Veladix Projects, the fourth projects in Manhattan, Lower East Side, Lower East Side, Manhattan. You know, we in Veladix. And if you're new to the channel, please subscribe, hit that notification bell for more daily content and live videos. Damn, this hood is really big. We're gonna cut down, back down. I never seen a projects with they mailboxes outside though. Never seen a project with mailboxes outside. It's the first time for me. Yes, it could be worse. It could, man. I mean, and I understand, you know, you're playing this, man. You you one out of how many that really cleans and do their job? Come on, you got housing workers that don't even clean their floors like they supposed to. At all. I mean, for my 27 viewers, what's going on, y'all? This is her views here. Uh, if y'all new to the channel, please subscribe. Hit that notification bell for more daily content and live videos. All right, so we at the end now. We about to exit Veladix Projects. Look like it's another side. Damn. If anybody's familiar with Manhattan, Manhattan projects, what's the biggest projects in Manhattan? Someone help me out. What's the biggest projects in Manhattan? Because this is the biggest projects I've been in by far in Manhattan. Let me know. What's the biggest projects in Manhattan, y'all? The biggest projects in all Manhattan, Harlem, Uptown, wherever, as long as it's Manhattan. What's the biggest projects in Manhattan? Spilatics is a big project. Small buildings, but big projects. For my 26 viewers that's here, man, if y'all enjoying this content, please give me a thumbs up. Give me a thumbs up if you're enjoying this content right now. Wagner, I think. Oh, yeah, Wagner is big. Tall buildings, too. Uh, it's the precinct over here. All right, so right now, so this is where it gets tricky at. As you can see, we're exiting Veladix. It's Veladix Projects. Lower East Side, four projects in Manhattan. All right, so this is what we're doing right now. For the ones that may be wondering, these buildings over here, these are uh, private owned. These are not NYCHA at all. But I'm gonna cut down here, and the next hood coming up, the fifth projects in Manhattan is Baruch. Baruch projects coming up. It's about a two block walk. Oh, someone said Baruch, then Polo, what, the biggest projects? You said Baruch and Polo is the biggest projects in Manhattan? Well, I've been through Polo. Polo's not that big. Polo got the tallest buildings. But Polo's not big at all. You know what I mean? Well, personally, in my opinion. And I filmed Polo. Right? Jefferson is big. Jefferson is big. Jefferson is big, yeah. You ain't lying. Yeah, it's a lot of big projects. Then when we talk about Harlem, yeah, Harlem got some big hoods. That might have got me with that. So right now, this is a, a private residential. I'm just walking through here to get to Baruch. 
over there, Baruch area. Now, when I hit Baruch, Baruch got like three projects all bunched up by Baruch. You got Baruch, Lillian Wool, then you got Jacob Rees. And that's all the projects on the, on the east side. It's about seven projects. And, a, and a, you know, I would say one mile, two mile radius, probably less than that. For my 27 viewers that's here, like I said, if y'all new to the channel, hit that notification bell for more daily content and live videos. Let me cross over. There's people walking behind me. Sometimes I got PTSD, man. People walking behind me. I don't feel comfortable all the time. Mm -hmm. But we all good, though. We good. Like I said, we good. Uh, so right now... And if y'all wondering why I do these videos, like I said, it's not to glorify anything negative. We're not promoting any violence on this channel. It's strictly just to show the world how it looks inside NYCHA developments. That's it. If y'all wondering, that's what it's strictly for. Mm -hmm. Appreciate you, brother. Appreciate you. So right here, this is like private owned. So 18 to 20 buildings in Velatics. Wow. Appreciate it, brother. That's a lot, though. And the way they got them set up, they all, like, connected to each other. Like, one side is connected. The other side is spaced out. So right here, y'all, we're looking at the <clears throat> Williamsburg Bridge. The Williamsburg Bridge over here. We're by, like, Avenue... Avenue D. Appreciate you, brother. Thanks for the subscribe. Appreciate you. Hope you stay in tune. So right here is the Williamsburg Bridge. And right there is Baruch Projects. To be honest, one of the most dangerous in the Lower East Side. Statistical-wise. And another thing, if y'all if wondering why some of my videos are titled most dangerous, one of the most dangerous, because statistical wise, they are. You know? Right there, they got some infrastructure over there. Mm -hmm. So Baruch is a big, big hood. I'm going to try and walk through the whole thing if I can, but I'm definitely going to get in the center of it as far as on the outskirts. Uh, oh, I forgot to tell y'all. It's actually more than seven hoods on the Lower East Side. We have compost, too. Compost is not straight ahead as the other hoods are, but more up on the left side. Everybody who's from NYC or, you know, no Manhattan or live in Manhattan knows about compost. They are nitrogen development. Right now, we enter in the Roots Projects, Lower East Side. Let's see where I'm going to. I'm gonna cut in through here. Cut it through here. Right here is Williamsburg Bridge. A lot of construction going on that's another thing too a lot of these developments got a lot of construction going on you know what i mean so that's a good thing that they are fixing up a lot of things in the hood so that's a good sign y'all for my people who do live in nature drop a like on this video right now let me get a thumbs up if you do live in nature right now and making the best of your situation let me get a thumbs up please y'all and shout outs to y'all and hopefully 
you know, the goal is to make it out. So this is Baruch. Baruch Projects. That goes the center. Daycare over here. It's the daycare. It's another thing I want to let y'all know. Every NYCHA development has a daycare. So for my single women out there, single mothers, if you have children, I know some of y'all don't trust daycares, but every NYCHA development does have a daycare. Yeah, for my 27 viewers here, what's going on, y'all? She got her views here. Subscribe to the channel. Please hit that notification bell for more daily content and future live videos. Now, what I'm trying to do, I'm trying to, so, pardon me, y'all. There's a lot of construction going on in, in Baruch. Pardon me, but these are the buildings over here. I made a took the wrong turn but usually you're able to walk through here i'm usually able to cut over there's a lot of construction going on right now so we cut through there mad construction yeah some mad construction going on so i'm gonna cut through here so you can see there's the buildings so y'all might can't see much, to be honest, cause yeah, everything's like blocked off. You know what I mean, everything's blocked off. So yeah, a lot of construction going on, but that's a good thing, y'all. It's definitely a good thing. Memories, yeah, man. That's and that's another thing. My channel does promote that, and that's what we here for—the memories. You got people that you know, '80s, '90s. Let's see. Let's go inside the building. Let's see how it is. So I guess it is inside the building of the roots. I'm not going to go upstairs because of the service. I don't want the lobby to cut off. But this is the lobby. As you can see, most housing developments do have cameras. You know? And another thing I want to let y'all know, trespassing, no trespassing. This right here is a friendly request. This is not lawful, this is unlawful right here. Cause housing is a public, it is a public, it is public property, and you cannot trespass on public property. Especially if you visit a relative or a mother or sister, brother, any family member. So he got that sign there, but that's just a friendly request. That is not lawful at all. That is not a law. But we're not here for the politics. Just want to let y'all know about that. Oh, on this dead end right here. What's this? Oh, there's another building, 79. All right, so yeah, there's a lot of construction going on, y'all. Pardon me. Let's get this show on the road. I'm gonna go exit out to the other side. As y'all can see, this is the other side. To get over there, I will have to go all the way around. So, what we gonna do is we gonna go back out the other way and keep it moving. Go to the next hook. Like I said, if y'all new to the channel, please subscribe. Hit that notification bell for more daily content and live videos. If you're wondering, what we're doing here, we're just walking through all the hoods in the Lower East Side, Manhattan section. All the housing developments. Now, all the hoods is pretty quiet. You know, it's holidays, so a lot of people, they out in other states, probably with their family and, you know, enjoying their time. I do love the holiday spirit in the hood. I always love people putting up the lights in their windows and decorating the hallways and the lobbies. 
always got to appreciate the holiday spirit in the hood. You know? For my 30, 30 viewers that's here, man, what's going on? Welcome to the channel. Please subscribe, hit that notification bell for more daily content and live videos. <clears throat> right now we in Baruch Projects, Lower East Side Manhattan. It's probably the end of it though. It is the end of it, I think. Right here, I guess there's where Night Nitra parked their vehicles at housing, parked their vehicles. That's another thing too, y'all be careful when y'all going to visit a family member in the hood in New York City, you know, parking is not free in the hood. They will tow your vehicle if you park your vehicle in these housing parking lots. Yes, or you will get a boot on your car. Yeah, I wanted to get to this side to show y'all the FDR side, bro. I mean, the way they got this set up, a lot of construction going on. Can't find my way over there. Mm -hmm. But we is going. Let's get out to the Ave, though. This way it's more active. At. Right across the street is Carlos. What's going on, y'all? If y'all new to the channel, please subscribe. Hit that notification bell for more daily content and live videos. If you're wondering what we're doing, we're walking through Lower East Side Projects, Lower East Side Manhattan. You know, just filming, showing the hood. Across the street, we got compost. Those compost projects. I think it's only like one building or two buildings. I will get y'all a view of that another day. We're gonna keep it pushing straight down the block. I had the Lillian Wall and Jacob Reeves. They're just fixing the hood up, though. As y'all can see, they're fixing it up. They're taking their time, though. They are taking their time. They are taking their time, but as you can see, I see the hood. It's being Baruch Projects right now. Yes! Yes, is that what you're watching? No! Yeah, shout out to Brooklyn, man. It's always love in Brooklyn. Especially Brooklyn's like the most, besides Manhattan, I mean, yeah, I mean, never mind. The other buildings on the outskirts. The reason why I did the outskirts, y'all, yeah, because I couldn't get to the other side due to the construction they got going on. Which is a good thing, they fixing up the hood, but I mean, at least I got y'all this section in the middle section. I apologize, y'all, if I can't keep the camera steady. My, my, my arms do hurt, though. <laughs> Trying to get the view of everything. See they fixing it up over here. Right now we are. Where we at? We on East Houston in Columbia. About to enter Lillian Wood. Let me catch this light. One thing about the city too, when we walking on no green light, so them cars will run you over. They don't stop for nobody. Right here, we about to enter Lillian Wall. 
And at the Lillian Wood is Jacob Rees. Jacob Rees. Uh, these two projects is probably more active than all the other hoods we walk with. Not, not that it's more crime going on or anything. I'm not too sure about that. But it's definitely active. And especially at night. Like, really active. They really outside. You know what I mean? I came through here a few times. We got the light. Let's see how we going with this. So right here, there's Lillian Wool. See the sign right there. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna start by the Av. Av. No, usually be a lot active on the outskirts. Bus. Right, y'all. So this is Lily and Wool. Oh, they got music playing. I do not want to get copyrighted. kind of do want to stay away from the music y'all they got playing over there through the copyright issues there's a lot happening over here i'm gonna cut through the next entrance Right now we in Lillian Wool, Lower East Side, Manhattan. Like I said, if y'all new to the channel, please subscribe, hit that notification bell for more daily content and live videos. They got music playing over here. I do not own copyrights to this songs they playing. Hope you two don't copyright me. As you can see, it's way different from the other hood. It's a lot more active over here. You know, people just vibing, playing their music. Y'all, if y'all new to the channel, please subscribe. Hit that notification bell for more daily content and live videos. So this is Lily Wood Projects. out patrolling watching the premises mostly every like Housing development that is active, do got the police patrolling, watching the premises. That's like normal. You no, know, in our younger days, we used to hate that police just in our face. And you know what I mean, but now as you get older and have kids, you kind of understand, like, you know, that's a whole nother conversation. It's the basketball court. I guess they did the basketball court over there. Nice. Some of the buildings. No 
mostly all the projects in the hand are very high rise all throughout the city. Every borough. Very few is like low rise. They're doing a lot of construction out here too. You can see a little bit. The sun came back over here with the music. You're having a good time. channel please subscribe hit that notification bell for more daily content and live videos right now we live in lilywood projects i'm gonna go to the end of the block first before and this is another thing y'all see it's the problem what we was talking about last time it's the problem we was talking about last time this is unacceptable as a community this is unacceptable housing gotta do a better job man Please give a like on this video, comment, thumbs up if housing got to do a better job, man. For our communities, this will bring rats and roaches and other rodents, man. I'm not going to cross the street yet because I don't not want to cross the street yet without informing y'all this is the end of Lillian War. But I'm pretty sure there's the end and across the street, that looks like Jacob Reeves. Indeed it is, it is. So right now, right now, if, if y'all new here, if y'all just now getting here, subscribe to the channel, hit the notification bell for more daily content and live videos. Right now we are entering Jacob Reed's projects in Lower East Side Manhattan section. Yes. It's very bright out here. This is the last hood on the Lower East Side of Manhattan. The last projects. And this is a very bright one. This hood is bright. So y'all can see everything. Too sure what this is. What is this supposed to be? Anyone know anybody familiar with Jacob Reese? Tell me what this is supposed to be right here. Somebody please. So I can see. This hood is bright. It's a bright project. View is going up. What's going on, y'all? If y'all new to the channel, please subscribe. Hit that notification bell for more daily content and live videos. I appreciate you rocking out with your boy Hood Views. We just walking through the hood right now. We in Jacob Reed's projects on Lower East Side. Dominique Gomez, you have family out here. Shout out to you. Shout out to you and your family. Let's see. I'm going to cross through the other side, y'all. And why I look mad lit. Good looking out, bro. Appreciate you, fam. A lot of people here, and, and y'all know New York City. Y'all know the city. People be taking the city bikes, man. And parking them up. <laughs> 
So a lot of the hoods, as y'all see, all the hoods we walk through has some form of construction going on. And that's a good thing. So they fixing it up. Fixing the hood up. All right, peace and love. So yeah, man, we and Jacob Rees. That's how it looks. It's the FDR side. I'm gonna go down here and get y'all a look at the FDR. A look, high rise buildings. Lower East Side, Manhattan. Whoever from Jacob Reeves or got family from Jacob Reeves, shout out to you and your family. I'm just gonna walk down here and show you how the FDR. And then I'm gonna walk back. So right here, I'm not too sure the name of this park, but this is a, 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 a very famous park in the summertime in Manhattan. A lot of birthday parties, a lot of graduation parties, a lot of cookout family gatherings, 4th of July, very, very popular park over here where you see a lot of families get together and kind of just, you know, enjoy themselves, you know? This is the FDR. Now, right here, down this way, it's where I came from. It's where we came from. That's southbound of the FDR. That starts from the ferry, Staten Island Ferry, all the way up to Harlem. And even possibly can lead you all the way to Jersey to the GWB, the George Washington Bridge. But yeah, y'all, yeah, this is the FDR drive. Let me go ahead and finish doing the walkthrough. My guy Flea, appreciate you, brother. Good looking out, fam. Shout out to you on a nice walkthrough. For my 38 viewers, if you knew, to the channel please subscribe hit that notification bell for more daily content and live videos appreciate the support it's looking like the end though oh nah it's not salute to you fam salute to you man Peace and love. There's they park right here. As you can see, all the hoods we walk through got some form of construction going on. And I say, and I say that to say, that is not a bad thing. That is a good thing, y'all. That means they are trying to fix up the hood. Well, they are fixing up the hood. Very slow progress though. Cause I'm pretty sure it's been like this for a while. <laughs> and another thing, and this, and this is right here, look at this. This is what I talk about, yeah? NYCHA has to do a better job with this. This is unacceptable. This is why our residents have rodents in a house, rats, roaches. This is what we go through in New York City housing. This is unacceptable. Housing has to throw this trash out and make sure it's in a compact. This is not good. And us as a community, we gotta keep it clean as well. We gotta we gotta do our part. You know, stop leaving trash in the hallways and you know. Yeah, it means the rent goes up too, John Smith. Yup, they fixing up the hood. That means the rent goes up. You know? You shop. Appreciate that. You shop. Let anyone in the chat know. That means the rent goes up. It's real muddy over here. 
It's a baddie. I appreciate you. Thank you so much. Hopefully, we have more content like this in the future. With me just going live and showing y'all the hood. And just giving y'all a different view of different hoods in the city. That's what it's about. Just showing the world how the hood look inside. You know? Oh. So, yeah, this is the other side. So, we ain't done yet. So, as you can see, this is like the, the circle part in the middle. You know what I mean? That's a little bridge that, that, like I was saying earlier, if you've been here for a while, you see that bridge right there? That bridge right there brings you to the other side, to that park we was just talking about, where people have their family gatherings and graduation, you know, parties and baby showers, all that. Yup, just because you live in a peace don't mean you gotta live like that, yup. Exactly. You know what I mean? Because I know people who make the best of it, who's, Households are very clean. Who keep their house very clean. As you can see, the police are rolling out. They're probably looking at me wondering what I'm doing. You know? As you can see, it's the high rise buildings, Jacob Reed projects. What's going on right now? We're walking through. I gotta be honest with y'all though, man. My arm is tired. <laughs> I gotta be honest, my arm is killing me. But it's all good, man. I got some more construction over here. High rise buildings. The city's, the city's full of high rise buildings, man. All the projects, high rise buildings. We at the end of the hood now. Yeah, they got a lot of construction going on in this hood. That's a good thing. Like I said, y'all, they fixing up the hood. You know what I mean? For my 33 viewers, if you're new to the channel, please subscribe. Hit that notification bell for more daily content and live videos. If you're wondering where we at right now, we are in Jacob Reed's Projects in Lower East Side, Manhattan. We just walked through Smith, Rutgers, LaGuardia, Valadix. Lillian Wool, now we in Jacob Rees. We even caught a glimpse of compost. But see, this is, this is, pardon me y'all, before I finish up, I wanna show y'all something. For my 33, 32 viewers right now, look at this. This is what we go through in NYCHA. This is what we, look at the rat. See the rat over there running? This is what we go through in housing. Housing has to do a better job with throwing out this trash. Especially around the holidays. They know families are throwing out a lot. Like, look at this. Look at the rats over here. They trying to get too close, but look at this. This is no good. This is it's disgusting, y'all. Please, y'all, give me a thumbs up if housing got to do better, man. Thumbs up on the video of housing got to do better, man. Our peoples cannot be living like this, man. Because this problem right here affects all. Affects all. This is no good. This is unacceptable. For real, man. Housing got to do better. Nature has to do better.
Disgusting. Yes, Lower East Side does have a big rap problem. That's a fact. BX Dill, what's going on, fam? They do have a big rap problem. And this is the reason. Look at this. Along with the construction they got going on, you know, breaking up the concrete and all that, and then this, this is unacceptable. Everything good, bro. You know, just doing a live video through the hood. I, if, if you just got here, fam, you, you missed all the other hoods we done walked through. We walked through the whole Lower East Side. Look at that rat running over there. It's crazy. But yeah, let me continue up. Let me continue with the mission, man. For real, y'all, but this is what we go through in New York City housing. Yeah, so this is the end. This is the last two buildings over here. It's the other basketball court. Well, I don't think I showed the basketball court yet. I think this is the only basketball court. I'm not sure. Uh, it's the park. Yeah, this is Jacob Reed. More construction going on over here. Last two buildings on this side. Two high rise buildings, two on the east side. If y'all new to the channel, please subscribe. Hit that notification bell. Stay tuned for more daily content and live videos. Right now, we on Avenue D and East 12th Street. Avenue D and East 12th Street. What y'all think, y'all? Should I keep the video rolling? Should I keep the video rolling, y'all? Should I keep the live going? And kind of like uh, walk up here to this development. It's, it's not housing, but it's like a, how can I put it? It's like a, a, a middle class projects, you know, for the middle class people. Y'all wanna see what that's looking like? Y'all wanna get a view of that? How about we do a walkthrough of the middle class projects where they got all the middle class people living at? This might be compost right here, if I'm not mistaken. This ain't housing. Yeah, security. Yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and end this soon, y'all. Like I said, if y'all new to the channel, if y'all just now getting in, y'all new to the channel, please subscribe, hit that notification bell. 
for more daily content and live videos. I appreciate y'all for taking the time to, you know, enjoy this live stream. Appreciate the love and support. We're going to end it soon, though. We will do more live videos like this in the future. Brooklyn, Bronx, Queens, Staten Island. Everywhere. Yeah, I was just about to say that. I was just about to say that, fam. I think this is compost across the street. Earlier, I made a misinform the viewers and telling them another development was compost. Let me see. Let me go ahead and check it out. Before I end the live, let me go ahead and check it out. I'm walking in the middle of cars. sure but I know Combo's got like two great buildings something like that let me see uh, nah I don't BX Dale, I do not think this is compost right here. Yeah, this ain't compost. But I do want to show y'all something. Before I do end the live, I'm going to go ahead and walk in here into like this middle class, upper class development that looks like projects, but, they, but they're not. And you just seen how we was looking, how the hoods was looking, you know, when we walk through the NYCHA and housing projects, let's see, let's do a comparison and see which ones is much cleaner, you know? Cause I'm pretty sure they got like their own management and, and maintenance people that come and clean. So we're gonna have walk through here and see how this look. This is not a hood. Just to let y'all know, this is not a hood. Yeah, it is. You right, fam, it is. I just looked at it, it's on the other side. Shout out to my guy, BX Dill. He know the city. My guy know the city. Right now we on East 14th Street. And I'm gonna enter here. This is private owned, I believe so. Private owned, middle class, upper class, residential complex, whatever you wanna call it. It's not housing, it's not the projects, and it's definitely not the hood. But we gonna walk through here in comparison and see the difference. Cause you know, I just walked, we just walked through seven projects in the Lower East Side and they all had a garbage problem we're leaving the garbage out I mean so we're gonna walk through here for those who's joining please subscribe to the channel hit the notification bell for more daily content and live videos This is different. This is this is a little different. So I can see. It's 
is like a middle class, upper class development, you know? And then across the street, they got the brownstones. Oh yeah, they got a gym right here. Yeah, this is definitely not the hood. As y'all can see, this is not the hood. This is not housing. And this is not the projects. This is a middle class, upper class development. And we're gonna walk through here just in comparison to see how they keep their development compared to our developments. Because, you know, I'm pretty sure they got like a, they own maintenance, people that work here that, you know, do get rid of the trash and everything and clean up the buildings and the grounds. So we're going to walk through here. Oh, yeah. Compost is right here. BX Dell, you was right, bro. Appreciate you. We're going to go ahead and walk through here real quick. I mean, for those who's just joining now, please subscribe to the channel, support, hit the notification bell for more daily content and live videos. I kind of like this. This is better than just filming through the hood. Doing the live. It's kind of more raw. It's kind of more. Yeah, so this is private property. And this is the map of the complex and how many buildings they have. Private property. I don't know the oh, name of it though. Really they got a security booth. Hold on, y'all. I'm just trying to get the name of this development. As y'all can see, this is a middle class, upper class development. Okay, Johnny. So yeah, as y'all can see, this is not the projects. This is not the hood. This is not NYCHA. This is not a housing development. This is a private property for middle class, upper class people. And now you see this? Look at the difference. Now, for, for those who was here from the last seven huds we walked to, please, y'all do see the difference, right? They got they trash properly properly okay so the same company that owns park chester owns this look at this they got they trash in here when i walked through the last seven developments they had they trash on the floor big difference Yeah. What's the rent here? I'm, that's what I want to wonder. I'm wondering what's the rent here? How much they pay rent here? They literally got like a project for middle class, upper class people. It looks like the projects, but it's not. It's not though. And BX Dell, 
Yo, you're right. It does look like Park Chester. A bigger version. Taller buildings. Yeah, this is way different from the hood. They even got a Christmas tree over there. We're gonna go over there, y'all. Check it out. For those who's just joining, I appreciate you taking your time out. Please subscribe to the channel. Hit the notification bell for more daily content and live videos. Look at their parks. They got nice benches, parks. I'm trying to understand, how can a private company have all this funding to make out a nice community where NYCHA housing is owned by the city, which us taxpaying citizens pay our taxes that fund New York City housing and our community's got to look messed up. But this is a private owned community and they have the funding to make all this look nice. Look how nice and bright it is. Like, this is crazy. Big difference. Big difference from the projects. It's a big difference from the hood, y'all. So my 31 viewers, if you're new to the channel, please subscribe. Hit that notification bell for more daily content and live videos. They got their own little calf and they development. Another calf over there. Yeah, this place is nice and clean. And sometimes, you know, the people that do live in here, it does make a difference. It does play a part. Unlike, you know, living in NYCHA, you know, a lot of people tend to not keep it clean, you know, not treat their community well. You know, loitering in the hallways, throwing trash in the hallways, don't have no respect for where they live at. Where unlike here, if you don't have respect for where you live at and don't keep it clean, they probably throw you out. Probably evict you. So, that's another thing. As you can see, this is the development for the middle class and upper class people. This is not housing, this is not NYCHA, this is not the projects, and this is definitely, this is definitely not the hood. But I'm not gonna lie, this is Really clean and neat, though. Everybody out here is like minding their own business.
What's going on, y'all? If y'all new to the channel, please subscribe. Hit that notification bell for more daily content and live videos. Uh, yeah, this is the end right here. First half. Whew. Wow. Appreciate that, Johnny. A one-bedroom starts at 4000 Definitely not the hood. This is definitely not the projects. But I just wanted to show y'all in comparison from the last seven hoods we just walked through how different it is. And a lot of people that's not from New York City that doesn't know the hoods in New York City will look at this and think this is a projects or this is housing and it's not. This is in no way, shape or form housing. This is a private property for middle class and upper class people. Totally different. If you are now just joining, uh, please support the channel. Subscribe, hit that notification bell for more daily content and live videos. Uh, I will try to do more live videos. Tom Rob, what's going on? You got a question? Yeah, we're going to end it up soon. Nah, this is not the projects, brother. This is not, uh, if you're just joining, uh, we just walked through the whole Lower East Side of Manhattan. If you're familiar with it, uh, we just walked through about, what, seven projects, and I didn't even have this on my bucket list. I just wanted to walk through here into comparison of how nature really looks. And compared it to, and it's, yeah, it's very much different. Right now, we're on First Ave and East 16th Street in Manhattan, in the east side of Manhattan, it's going towards Midtown. And like I said, if you're new to the channel, I just want to let y'all know I appreciate the love and support. Please subscribe to the channel. Hit the notification bell for more daily content and live videos. Yeah, they do look the same, brother. They do. A lot of people will get confused and think these are projects, but they're not. Like I said, these are privately owned apartment complexes for middle class and upper class people. This is not the projects. But like I said, if y'all just now joining, uh, I am gonna end the live soon. I appreciate y'all stopping by. Hopefully, y'all be able to check the other content I got on the channel. Uh, yeah, so if y'all new to the channel, please subscribe, hit the notification bell for more daily content and live videos.